Question 20. So let's rearrange the linear part first. Uh, that's actually an equals there. So that's just going to be 2x plus 5. Then just parachute it in replace of the y there. So then we get x squared. So we've managed to get something, but we don't want it containing x and y. We just want it to contain one letter. So we got y squared. Well, y is this. So we've got 2x add 5 squared, and we know that that's equal to 25. Right, so x squared plus... Now, be careful when you multiply this out. That's going to be 4x squared plus... Now, you've got 10x and 10x there. Right, it's going to happen twice. So we can actually have 20x and then plus 25. And then remember the whole thing is equal to 25. Well, we've got, let's just tidy this up, we've got 5x squared plus 20x. Take away 25 from both sides, so that equals 0. OK, so let's factorise. Take out 5x, and then we get x plus 4 equals 0. Right, so what's going to make this 0? Well, x could equal 0, or it could equal minus 4. What you need to do now is you need to take these values, you need to find out the corresponding y values. So you've actually got two possible solutions, haven't we? So we've got x equals minus 4, x equals 0. Now the easiest thing to do is just to go and pop those up into this one up here. So that would give me, so when x is 0, y would have to be 5. So there's one possible solution. And then the second possible solution, if I substitute minus 4 into that, that gives me minus 3. So there's our second solution.